Hey, I'm Dave Lieber, the Fort Worth Star-Telegram Watchdog columnist and also the founder of WatchdogNation.com, a movement designed to show Americans how to bite back when businesses and scammers do you wrong. I'm just finishing up my report for the Watchdog Nation and the Star-Telegram about MoneyGram. Have you heard about MoneyGram? It's unbelievable. They have to pay $18 million to victims, according to a Federal Trade Commission settlement, but what really bothers me about this is the FTC has found that one out of ten Canadian agents for MoneyGram in Canada are con men involved with the flim flammers doing all the scams, taking money from grandmothers who think their kids are stuck in Canada, fake lotteries, fake sweepstakes, fake employment ads, fake mystery shoppers. MoneyGram is involved and it's shocking. You can read the report at watchdognation.com search for the word money gram if it doesn't come right up. But uh, one of the things that really bothers me about this is I uh, couldn't get anything out of the company, no surprise. I wrote to Linda Micheludi, who's the spokeswoman for MoneyGram, and I said, it's a pretty bad blow to the company's reputation. 10% of Canadian agents allegedly involved in the scamming, one of the biggest FTC financial settlements with a company in years. The company allegedly notified of these problems and not handling them. This seems like a disaster in trustworthiness and credibility. Please tell me if I'm wrong and why. We had been in communication, but she never bothered to answer. I don't know what you can say when the Federal Trade Commission says that your company executives were notified, notified about this on a grand scale, the amount of flim flaming going on with the MoneyGram agents and they did nothing and the whistleblowers who were notified were disciplined or they were fired okay anyway read about it on watchdognation.com MoneyGram thanks